Well, everyone, ChatGPT Plus is one of those really cool AI type of subscription models that you can go ahead and subscribe to. With Google AI Pro, it's essentially kind of the same thing. Google AI Pro was basically that new type of, you know, format that Google has kind of given us where it kind of replaces Google Gemini Advanced. So it essentially gives us the type of capability of getting a lot more features built inside of our AI tools that we use on an everyday basis, but they're not cheap, but they're not super expensive, and we do have to basically pay for them. So we'll take a look at it throughout this whole entire video. Number one, the price tag of both these is roughly around the same. So you're getting around a $20 price tag between both of these. So whether you're going for a Google AI Pro or you're getting for, you know, ChatGPT Pro, this it's the same thing. They're both $20 a month. So you're not really getting anything like super different, I would say, when it comes down to both of these from that particular side. Now, some big things to keep in mind here. Number one, if you're looking at both, a big thing to keep in mind here is that with ChatGPT Plus in this particular situation, it does come out with, you know, GPT-40, the Omni model. So this basically allows you to get higher limits to some really, really good options. So that model in and of itself, I would say, is actually very nice. It's a very, very good type of model to be able to use. And, you know, it's pretty much industry standard. This and the Gemini models, they're both like very, very much so like industry standard. So you're going to be able to pick them up, use them, and be able to do a lot of things that you're going to be wanting able to do with them. You also have higher limits when it comes down to the voice options as well. So kind of having conversations with, you know, ChatGPT. You have that type of capability right within ChatGPT Plus as well. Now with Google AI Pro, this is also basically the same type of standard as something like ChatGPT Plus. So with Google AI Pro, you're basically getting the ability of kind of going through and getting access to the Gemini 2.5 Pro model. So this model is actually very good. I think it's a very, very nice model for the most part. With a model like this, you're essentially going to be able to go through and not only get access to the same types of things that GPT Plus kind of gives you, which is like a higher usage, higher limit for the more advanced models. The coolest thing I would say with ChatGPT Plus or with the you know, Google AI Pro is the higher limits that you can use. But with Google Plus AI Pro, you have the VO2 access. So VO2, which is a tool under their flow ecosystem, it allows you to basically go through and start kind of like creating videos from text. Now, ChatGPT Plus has the, you know, Sora video generator option. So that right there is a really cool thing. But within Google AI Pro, you also have that type of capability right there, which I think is another really cool thing. And I am a massive fan of that when it comes down to it. So if I'm about to go through and like pick up some sort of a device, I genuinely do think or pick up a subscription model, having that type of capability right there, I think is a really cool thing. And I am a massive fan of that kind of stuff when it comes down to it. So again, it's not the biggest deal in the world, but if I'm about to go through and pick up a subscription model, I want it to be able to give me that type of capability. And that is kind of essentially what's going on here for the most part. So I, for one, I'm a massive fan of that type of stuff when it comes down to it. Now, it really just comes down to you, whether you want to go and pay for a subscription model, or if you're okay with your current subscription model that you have, right? If you don't currently you know, pay for a subscription model at all, would you want to go ahead and, I mean, do you get enough usage out of your current ChatGPT or Google Gemini? Do you need more, you know, do you need more power? Do you need more features? If not, then I think the standard type of, you know, Google Gemini is probably okay, right? Or the standard version of ChatGPT+. Plus. But if you are wanting a little bit more of an upgrade, I would probably say going up to the plus I would say ChatGPT Plus is great, but Google AI Pro with the new offering with its storage limit increase, that one kind of gives me a more of a reason for people to go ahead and buy something like Google AI Pro because you're getting, you know, storage built inside and you're getting the AI features built inside as well. So I would say Google AI Pro is probably the better deal when it comes down to it. If you have any other thoughts or questions, please let me know in the comment section below. Hit the like button, that means so much, but definitely hit that subscribe button. More importantly than everything else, I love every single one of you guys. Hopefully I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace out, so then.